Here's how to use your Apple gift card to buy iCloud storage. Now, if you're on your phone and you're running out of iCloud storage, you can always use a gift card instead of the card on file to basically buy added storage. I'll show you how to do it, but first hit the subscribe button down below. It really helps me out. Thanks guys. Now let's tap on the app store here. First, we need to go in the app store and make sure that gift card is added as balance on your account. So tap on the profile at the very top right here. And then from here, you can see midway down is redeem gift card or code. I'm going to tap on that. And basically, it allows me to enter in the code manually if I tap it on there or just hit use camera. And it will basically just scan for that code. So just enter in the gift card code to be able to add it on there. You'll know that it is on there because you can tap on the profile at the top right. And you can see right under my name, it says credit in this case is $5. So I have $5 added from a gift card onto my account. Now, after you've done that, let's head into your settings here. Let me go all the way back. I need to go all the way back here and tap on your name at the top. And then we'll tap on iCloud. Now, if you want to buy more storage, you're just going to tap on storage at the very top. And you can see I'm using 1.2 terabytes of two terabytes. I'm gonna hit change storage plan. And now I can go through the process of choosing what I want. So in this case, let's say I'm upgrading to six terabytes per month. Now, when I hit buy at the top right, it will pop up to double click to subscribe to this. And it will say cancel anytime, Apple account will be auto renewed. And basically it will bill my Apple account. So keep in mind, if you do go through this process, I'll show you what it will bill. So let's go back out of here. And on here, let's tap on payment and shipping. Now, at the very top, it will bill this credit card, but first, Apple always defaults to using your Apple account balance. So you can see at the very top Apple account, I have a balance of $5. It will always default to using that first, unless you tell it not to, and then it will use after that your backup credit card or debit card if you don't necessarily have enough credit on your Apple account through that gift card to use it to buy more storage. I hope this helps. If it did, hit the like button down below and leave a comment if you still have any questions. Thanks, guys.